Hello everyone, today we're going to install Windows XP on Windows 10. So let's begin. First, let's double click on VirtualBox. Then click New. Pick the type of virtual machine. So I'm working with Microsoft Windows, right? The version, which I'm going to be working with. Windows XP, so pick Windows XP 32 bit. On the file location, I'll have a location for my virtual machine, so I have to create one. And this is the default location where it is, but I'm not I'm gonna put it in a different directory. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna copy and paste this section of the name, right? And then I'm gonna hit this drop down and click other. And then I'm going to scroll down and go to my PC. And this is one of my other hard drives. I'm going to click on data. Then I'm going to just right click, new, new folder. Then paste, enter. This will be the new location for my virtual machine storage. Click on select folder. Now the name is going to be Windows. Oh, excuse me. Let me take this off. Windows XP. Click next. What well, I have 32 gigs in my machine, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give it a decent amount. I'm gonna give it uh, about um, 1024 which is about approximately or it is a gigabyte click next leave everything by default click create uh, the file type VDI virtual boxes as images click next keep everything as, as default click next the file location um, this is the storage size for my virtual machine. I uh, just gonna leave everything by default. 10 gigabytes is enough for this demonstration. Create. Give it a moment. Click start. Give it a moment. If you have the original Windows XP CD or a duplicate. You can pop it in in your DVD drive, Blu-ray drive, whatever type of drive you have, right? But for this demonstration, I'm I have an ISO file. So what I'm gonna do is browse, click on Add, then I'm going to my data drive, then my ISO folder, client. Then this is the ISO for Windows XP. Double click. Choose. Then start. Give it a moment. Okay, time to set up Windows. Click Enter. Click on F8 on your keyboard. Hit the Enter key. I'm going to keep everything by the fault and just hit Enter. Now this process is going to take a while to finish. So I'm going to fast forward. Going 
going to keep everything by default. The language is already set to English and the keyboard layout is set to US keyboard. Click next. Type the full name and the name of your company or organization. I'm going to type in Ray. Click next. This part here, I have to input the serial key. At this moment, I'm going to put the serial key. I might have to skip this section here. Give me a moment. Just finish putting the serial key. Now for the computer name, I'm going to leave it as default. Now if you desire, you can change the computer name. Same goes with the administrator password. So if you choose to create one, it's up to you. But for this video demonstration, I'm not going to add or create a uh, administrator password. Click next. Keep everything by default. Click next. And this will take a, a few minutes. Based on my computer settings, everything is going to be extremely fast, but I'm going to let it run as it, as it is. Um, this is the network setting, correct? Yes. Click next. Uh, it's going to be on a work group. I'm going to just keep as it as it is. Click next. Give it some time. I'm going to mute myself. Okay, so click next. Click not right now. Click next. Connected to the internet. Just skip this step. Ready to activate Windows? Yes, over the internet. Click now. Next. Are you ready to register online for Microsoft? No, not right now. Or not at this time, excuse me. Then click next. Can I reach? All right. This makes sense because this the key that I had has been the I, I, it should be expired already by this time because uh, I know those those servers are, shouldn't be working. But either way, let's continue. I have 60 days, so I can still work with the with this ISO. Click next. Your name. I'm going to put my name, Raymond, and click next, and that's it, and finish. That brings back good old memories, and this is how you install Windows XP. Like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Peace.